What's up guys? Welcome to my channel again. Uh, today is a little, it's gonna be a little crazy. <laughs> because I have over here my, my my baby over here, as you see, the KDM 1290 Super Duke. And, um, and that's what I wanna do right now is, I'm gonna show you right now. <laughs> as you see the wheel, it's full of, all the wheel is orange so I want to do it like a half white and it's gonna be a little crazy because I'm gonna do it by myself so I hope it, it came, came out good so let's take everything apart I'm gonna take all the wheels and uh, I'm gonna clean them I'm gonna do it with some paper <clears throat> a little bit of the wheels a little bit and then I'm gonna I'm gonna tape all the lines um, with this tape over here let me show you the 3M um, the stripping vinyl tape that's how they call it and I'm gonna make my own design the way I want you know the white to be and the orange to be like half and half I'm gonna show you a little bit after I, I take them out so yeah all right guys just took everything out it was pretty easy it took me like uh, 15 minutes i think um as you see over here that's how the bike looks now i like no rear no rear wheel no front wheel you know it's nice and secure over here so it's not nothing can happen nothing you know it doesn't it doesn't slow down as you see over here rear wheel pretty clean I'm gonna take everything apart I'm gonna take out the disc brakes uh, both sides I'm gonna take the, the tires off I'm gonna clean everything I don't want any oil to be on the tire on the on the rim so yeah that's it I'm gonna take of course I'm gonna take this out so I took everything apart of the of the of the wheels uh, I took out the, the, ro the rotors the disc rotors the the seal for the dust so it's not going in the bearings and after you know after before I spray I'm gonna cover everything so I don't get messed up again and then after I take out the tires I'm gonna take these valves out well, so it's the time now I didn't go yesterday so I'm gonna go today over there uh, take everything take everything over there take the tires out and then and then come back at the in the garage like, and finish the job just came on the sub my friend's sub over here as you see my wheels the tire machine let's take them out over here have my my wheels my rims no tires on so next thing I'm gonna take out the the, the pressure sensors I'm gonna take them out so it can be like a nothing on the on the rim so after that I'm gonna start sanding up and uh, make it ready for for pain do it.
Yoshi already taped and covered the whole rear wheel. So I want to do first the one. I want to make sure everything goes well with the, with the paint. I'm going to try this one with assemble. Probably I'll make it work the way I the way I think. So I believe I believe it's going to come out good. So I'm going to start painting right now the first coat of, of the white color and then I'm going to do probably like three coats. And as you see over here the the wheel so it's already taped uh, I sand it I sand it so it doesn't have any like even signing as you see all the way around whatever whatever is not taped it's gonna be white so let's let's start painting and I hope everything goes well <laughs> let's see That's finished the, uh, as you see, the white color coat is done. Came out pretty good. It's shiny, almost. <laughs> so I'm gonna take everything apart, like every all the tape out, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna spray the clear coat. So it's not gonna be fun right now. It was a little scary when you take out the, the tapes. So whatever. Let's see how it goes. Finish untaping on the rear wheel. I didn't know it's gonna be that hard, and uh, but uh, it came out good. So you check it out. The way it looks. The lines are perfect. You see. You know, with the stripping tape, everything comes comes perfect and uh, smooth and nice cuts and everything. So as you see, the wheel is ready. And as you see, I think I, I made it pretty sender. One more step. 
for the for the rims so let's take a look front front wheel looks amazing look at this lines are perfect Here is the rear. Amazing guys. It came out so good. So I'm gonna I'm gonna spray the last the last coat, the clear coat. Uh, and it's and it's gonna be done. I'm gonna let it dry at night and then tomorrow I'm gonna probably afternoon i'm gonna go put the tires back and then put it back on the on the bike and then let's see how it's gonna look i think it's gonna look amazing all right let's spray the, the clear coat now all right guys uh i just missed something i forgot to press the button for the for, to record the time I, I spray the clear coat but it's fine uh so let me show you how they came they came out look at this they so shiny i'm telling you they came out really good uh i wasn't expecting that good it, it was the first time i do it so it came out pretty good i'm telling you i love it i love it look at this and I can't wait to put these beauties on the beast. All right, guys, everything went well. We put everything back. Uh, as you see over here, I just put it on. I didn't screw it yet. Um, I'm gonna get the torque range and I'm gonna screw everything uh, the way it's supposed to be. So, by right now, Look at this guys, it looks amazing and it goes so well with the, with the bike. I'm really excited from, from the results. Uh, I just hang the, the, front, the front wheel like that. I don't want to put it anywhere because I didn't put air in the tires yet. Um, because I want to make sure everything is okay and I want to clean everything in, in, in here. So let me put back everything. And then later I'm gonna go all around the bike. I think it's gonna be awesome. All right, let's keep doing it. Bike right now it looks amazing. Look at this. That's it, guys. It's finally done. I'm really excited the way it came up. So right now the next 
next project I'm gonna do. I'm get, it's gonna be a little one, a little, a little bit. So <laughs> I wanna do, I wanna do a little bracket. I'm, I'm gonna do a little bracket custom. Uh, I'm going to measure everything from this bolt. Okay, bolt. If I can screw the bolt, two bolts over here, and then I'm gonna put the line display over there. And I'm gonna do it all, by, all of it by myself. And I'm gonna get a little help of my friend uh, who does the 3D printing. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make the mount for the line display uh, to be nice and clean because I don't like it because I have it with zip tights. So I want to get rid of the zip tights. So. That's it guys. See you at the next at the next video. Stay safe.